Hello and thank you so much for joining. I'm Del Dape and I am sitting in my kitchen underground. Behind me the ovens are getting on the temperature because I want to bake a couple of pies that I have left over. So today we are going to build a new kitchen because I have changed my mind on the original plans. First of all, let me put in a couple of uh, pies and I am going to explain to you. My original plan was uh, to expand and uh, make this uh, kitchen look better. I wanted to expand four blocks over there and get some uh, sunlight uh, get in from the surface. But I made some attempts uh, on a test world and I didn't manage to make it look uh, um, as I wanted and uh, it was also not that functional. So I changed my mind and I decided to build my kitchen over here. Because this room is always completely empty. I am using only the half of the walls and uh, I don't know what else uh, do with that. So this is the cellar. What I want to do is to keep this underground floor for the food production. So I'm going to convert, uh, remove everything here and convert this in cheese production or even better alcohol production. Then I'm going to dig uh, further when I need it to make other rooms and other cellars. Right now um, I think that uh, to have the kitchen down here is not uh, uh, relevant any longer. It was my original idea on the starting of the series, but right now I changed my mind really. Here I want to build the kitchen. I want to go out another couple of blocks here and uh, so I can make a chimney and the chimney is gonna cover this and the other window. So uh, I am going to remove those windows but probably that way I can get rid of this um, boxy shape that I'm used to. It looks like much more a box and uh, I want to give a little bit more um, a different shape. If I have time today I want also to improve and expand the stone path and try to bring it over to the, the gate and put some stairs because it looks ugly right now. Everything is looking unfinished and I want to finish some stuff. Talking about boxes, there is uh, something else that looks like a box and it's this one. This is uh, uh, my greenhouse that I built really in a hurry because uh, it was already winter and I was a little bit short in uh, vegetables. So I decided to build this without caring too much about aesthetics. But now, as you can see, it works pretty fine, but it doesn't look nice. I want to give a better shape to this greenhouse and probably I want to build another one, as I already thought, here. And probably another one here. So I have a group of three or four of them. I'm pretty sure that it's gonna look very, very well. Before we start with the working, I want to give you some updates. First of all, I activated the third translocator in my private hub. As you can see, I have a group of three uh, of four translocators and I call it the mini hub because uh, it reminds me of the big, uh, large uh, hub on Chromatec. Now, as you can see, three of them are violet and one is red. This is broken, the other three are activated. Now, I activated the third one and the third one brought me a little bit north. And I was north here and I found this local goods trader, pretty comfortable there, it's pretty close. Uh, there's also a family of wolves here and I've seen uh, some resin that I have to inspect. Probably, oops, uh, probably this is going to be a resin forest and could be pretty um, 
handy to have. Interesting thing of this uh, translocator is uh, the group of uh, stones that we have. We have clay stone, shale, we have uh, uh, basalt and as you can see here we have finally chalk. This is a lot of chalk and uh, now I finally can uh, make some lime and some other stuff. So I collected already, uh, where is it here, a little bit, a couple of stacks. One is gonna uh, go into the quern right ahead. Since I'm poor, I have to do, <laughs> I have to do like that. I cannot do in other way uh, right now. I'm still a poor guy and uh, put it back that. And with this I'm going to make uh, uh, some mortar and probably some uh, um, plaster. Also the chalk uh, is pretty pretty white. Uh, I like it. It's a, a very white, um, brilliant white and I can use it also for uh, dry stone and uh, for bricks. I really like it. It's a, a, a pretty nice uh, white in the uh, sunlight. One like that, and I should have also a uh, but we don't need because we can always do like that. Okay, we can always use a slab and then chisel it. And uh, with the chisel, we could fill the block so we can also save some materials if you want uh, to chisel. And this should, uh, you know, sustain a little bit that uh, that uh, part of the roof, even if uh, um, it's not really beautiful, but it can uh, uh, work with that. Okay, now I will uh, make the other two the other two uh, ovens, and then I need to check uh, on the top floor how to finish the, the thing here. Yep. Okay, so this is protected now from the fire. Right? This is also... And then I could make the chimney going uh, up uh, all the way up there. And then I could make my really quick god intervention and put a couple of uh, uh, that smoky chimneys that are only available in creative mode, just to give the touch. Yeah, it's not really dark. I will replace it one day. I don't like it. I would love to have some slate. Give me four of that. Yeah, it can make the, the job uh, uh, without any problem.
and it should work. I make four copies because I want to have uh, one original to, to have on a side. I don't know, I'm used to that. Okay, so let's see how it looks. Now, I made a mistake because of course this is chiseled now. Okay, it should be, uh, it should look like that. Okay, this should be the um, the kitchen now. That could place also a couple of these. Yeah, all together it can work, all together. For now it can work. Uh, let's see how it uh, it works with uh, with real fire on top of it. It's not working. There was a problem with my design. As you can see, you have the box of the uh, fire that uh, it's exactly like that. So you can chisel out outside the box, but uh, you have to keep that uh, completely flat. Otherwise, uh, the grass is not gonna stick and the fire cannot be placed. It's only like that. So uh, basically I could, let's say that I could go now and chisel all this part without any problems, but I cannot chisel underneath. Uh, yeah, I could now, but it's, uh, it's, not, uh, it's not that um, good to do. So I'm gonna let them like that. I like the design anyways. Uh, this uh, is my new kitchen. Let's see. With the fire on top. Yeah, it looks uh, it looks also nice. It's not uh, that bad. Here we go. I can still uh, improve it and uh, put other chiseling stuff. I could also remove that and put some granite. I will improve it, but right now I like it way better. Because uh, now I can put uh, my table scene and everything and I can put a chimney on top there. Of course I want to go all over, it has to be higher of this um, floor, otherwise it doesn't make sense to have a chimney if it's in front of the windows. As usual, if you have... Oh. If you have suggestions or uh, tricks, you can tell me in the comment. I would really appreciate that. Let's 
So we have uh, the new kitchen and it's working pretty well for now. I need to make now, first of all, I need another, uh, I need another chest. Drop that. Drop that. I need one other chest for the chiseling stuff. Yeah, put it there for now. Like that. Glass. I can drop the glass here. Oh, I have another uh, chimney. Well, it's uh, I can keep it on keep it on the side for now. Let's take a look. Yeah, it's not really really beautiful. I still have to to work a bit with that. Could also place two windows uh, on the back there. Let me see if it's working. So we can see also from from the outside. Let me see. Hmm. Yeah, well, uh, from the outside is uh, looking fine. Look. I want also to to make a border uh, with wood or something just to make it look nicer. I'm not totally good with um, I'm not sure about having the uh, ovens uh, on top here and I don't want to make them um, stick outside the wall but I could because I have room. I have this room, they could also be like that and two there so I could have uh, six and put some of the some of the wood here like that why not looks pretty interesting yeah it looks better now we have the, the smoke is uh, smoking up and uh, yeah it's way way better then I have to enclose it uh, on the floor here because otherwise uh, you know uh, yeah it's enclosed I have just to to do something here of course uh, this uh, this area is not gonna be used probably I could put another uh, fireplace here but look at that it looks great now probably four are too many but I don't care I need one chisel. And I need another pickaxe because mine is almost gone. see if we can finish that for sure what do I miss of oh, those
Okay, let's see if I can uh, replace it. Yeah, it looks better. I need to then to replace also these uh, with normal. I think I'm gonna do it right now. Yeah. Okay. And then I'm gonna replace that too. And probably... Let me see. Yeah, also over there. did it like that. Oh, well, that uh, was a mistake. I need a... Uh... some more. solve it. Oh, I like it, I like it. I can also walk on that. This is uh, almost, the almost finished thing. I don't think I can manage today to, to improve also the, the greenhouse. Uh, right now it's not uh, uh, completed yet. I want to make some other um, changes and also over there probably I'm going to, to do something. I want to remove that uh, and the other, the other uh, wood here because I don't really like it like that. But for now, I'm pretty happy about it. It looks uh, interesting. It looks nice. I can then uh, um, refine a little bit the decorations. Let me check the... Uh, oh, we need uh, more. Yeah. We need way more. Like that. It should be, if I'm not mistaken, uh, two pit bricks for each um, one. Hmm. So uh, it should be like that. Yes, I'm going to place another two of these um, clay ovens and it should be looking pretty fine. Now I have to produce much more lanterns, I'm going to do that. Uh, I'm going to cast some metal off camera, but this is material for the, the next episode. Thank you very much for watching, I always appreciate that. I really enjoy sharing my time with you. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have suggestions, you can uh, write me in the comment. I would really appreciate that. Thank you very much for watching. We will see you the next time. Since then, have a nice one. Bye-bye.